okay? I don't know. Can you hear me? Somebody say you can hear me. That would be good. Uh, hi, Doc and everyone. I see that. Hi, Sue. Welcome. And, uh, yep, Billy Bob Joel says, yes. Yes, you can hear me. Okay, echo, echo, echo. Can hear me, can hear me, can hear me. I hear you from a Sue. All right, cool. I'm happy everybody can hear me. <coughs> I'm still uh, pushing buttons here trying to figure out uh, why I'm only seeing half a screen. Okay, there we go. All right, so uh, I am in the vehicle. Uh, we are going to be heading over to Candy Cane Lane shortly. Uh, what I am uh, doing is actually I'm at a 7-Eleven right now. Got myself a Pepsi and uh, actually I'm going to have a little drink. Uh, welcome on board everyone. I know there's no fancy music and no uh, neat stuff and all that, but uh, this is uh, from the mobile. Uh, and I do apologize that this is only a 720 and not a 1080p, unfortunately. So I do apologize for that. My phone just won't do that. We're going to have to uh, figure that one out in the future. But uh, hopefully uh, you can hear me okay. Uh, is the... Uh, a heater and noise are too loud. I'm just wondering if it's uh, rumbling too much or uh, you guys have no problem hearing me. Okay, nobody commented on the, uh, the in-car heater being on with the fan. It is fairly noisy. Uh, we can handle it. All right, uh, Billy Bob. No worries, uh, I can hear you. Okay, cool. All right, let's uh, get going here. Otherwise, we'll be here all day or night. We don't want to be here all night. Anyway, uh, let's get going. So, exiting the 7-Eleven parking lot on 76th Avenue, going right down. And uh, we are heading through a school zone right away aka also known as a playground zone so must maintain 30 kilometers an hour here in Edmonton and uh, that is effective of uh, that sign that says 30 kilometers an hour golly gee I wonder how people can figure that one out anyway uh, that is uh, where we are and uh, uh, let's see uh, just uh, trucking along here so hopefully uh, the uh, picture quality is good enough um, I didn't bring my cleaning stuff along, unfortunately, but uh, if it is uh, too bad, we will figure out something. Uh, we uh, do have some cleaning material here that uh, we may be able to utilize, like windshield washer fluid. <laughs> There's a whole bunch of it in that jug underneath the hood there somewhere. Anyway, all cool, and uh, yep, I see uh, there are 21 on board. Sasha, welcome, and Tetra is here. Welcome, uh, Tetra. Glad to have you on board. And uh, if uh, there are any of the moderators in here, uh, mods, if you're in here, uh, could you uh, drop the link for this in the bunny stream? Uh, that would be uh, really cool if you could do that. If there's a mod in here, uh, would be uh, would be awesome. And uh, if uh, Actually, if uh, maybe uh, somebody can find uh, CMB boy, if he's not around, maybe uh, check with uh, Gary over at 24/7 uh, Live AZ Skies. He may be able to do something and uh, drop the link into uh, my uh, bunny stream uh, so uh, people can see it. Uh, that would be cool. Uh, yeah, I don't know where Piggy is. She hasn't hopped in yet. Uh, she's probably going to jump in on the fly here. Hopefully. Anyway, uh, we'll, uh, we'll get going. And uh, see what we can do. We're uh, on uh, 76th Avenue westbound. And uh, we are sitting at 109th Street. Uh, here in the uh, lovely city of Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. Just so you know where you are. Uh, this is sunset after a sunset in Virginia. Cool, Tetra. Well, you get two sunsets today. Uh, we won't charge you any extra for this one. <laughs> and uh, 
see now you see the exhaust coming from the vehicles of course now it's it's only a minus uh, what is it a minus eight degrees Celsius out there <coughs> pardon me if it was uh, colder than that we would have a heck of a time uh, seeing because uh, that uh, cloud would be uh, two or three times as big and uh, that would really really mess us up so that's yeah, one of those things but anyway we are uh, driving along here we should be okay and uh, we actually see our first Christmas lights but uh, this is not candy cane lane <laughs> over on the right hand side uh, that is a uh, pretty cool and it looks like I've got the phone sitting in the right spot today which is really good anyway this area over here is actually a McKernan is uh, what they call it McKernan and uh, we are on 76th Avenue uh, coming up to uh, 114th Street so uh, pretty cool pretty awesome uh, you got the McKernan uh, uh, Junior High or some McKernan school on the right hand side anyway and uh, we are going to go left because we are going to go uh, on to uh, uh, Belgravia and then on to uh, what they call uh, Fox Drive and uh, that's where we like to hang out Fox Drive <laughs> anyway uh, let's uh, see if uh, we're going here um, somebody let me know what uh, what time is it now I'm just curious because I think my clock in my van is wrong doesn't look right. It says 417 and I don't believe that. It's got to be like 4, uh, 649 as 749. Uh, 6, wow. Well, 6.50 Eastern. Uh, that'd be 4.50 in my time. Uh, that makes more sense. Okay. Uh, where's my light switches in here? Do they shine upon them there? No. Time. Let's see if we can adjust the uh, minutes here. Oh, my fancy dancy thing. And I've got a pin in my pocket so I can actually uh, push the little buttons in. All right. Uh, so 4:50 uh, local time here. That's all cool. I got that written down. Or I've well, got it uh, fixed up. That's what it's on the clock now. And. Uh, what happened? Uh, ooh, what Brits? Are there Brits in here? <laughs> Echo the bot. It's not cold. Come on. It's uh, nice. It's only minus 8 degrees Celsius, which is it's warm, isn't it? What's that in Fahrenheit? Like about uh, 70 or something? T-shirt weather? <laughs> oh too much fun. Anyway, we're on 114th, and uh, we will uh, go south a little bit here, and then up uh, just at the intersection here, we'll make our, our right-hand turn, and uh, we'll get into uh, that lane right away. And uh, there we go. Get over a little bit, and hopefully it's not uh, too icy out. As you can see, the uh, roadways have been sanded a little bit and stuff, so it's not bad driving out here. I mean, it could be worse. You can see all the, uh, the sand and dirt and everything on the uh, roadway, uh, possibly some salt mixed in there. Of course, that's good for your vehicle, right? Uh, let's see. Did that Irish monk make it in here yet? I know he was uh, looking to go on for a drive uh, down Candy Cane Lane. Anyway. So this, uh, this road here is Belgravia Road. Uh, off uh, to the uh, right hand or left hand side is uh, a place you don't want to be, but you'll probably end up there. <laughs> uh, that is the... Uh, Morgue <laughs> and the crematorium, uh, but uh, that's okay. Uh, they uh, uh, they don't uh, don't do their thing too often there. Anyway, um, going.
going on to Fox Drive now, and uh, that will take us uh, out to 149th Well, it will take us out to um, the uh, White Mud Freeway, and uh, when we get on the White Mud Freeway, we'll stay in the right-hand lane, and we will end up uh, going uh, uh, up 149th Street, so everything uh, should be cool here. Anyway, that's all my good. Um, how's the uh, picture quality, you guys? Everything uh, okay there? You can see fine, and uh, it's not a bad visibility. Shouldn't be too bad. Uh, the window isn't the greatest, but, you know, it should be all right uh, for this. It's good. Okay, Sue, that's excellent. Hey, Piggy! I saved you your seat up front here. Now, Piggy, no sticking your head out the window today. You can't do that, okay? You have to behave. It's cold out there. You don't freeze your snout. Anyway, uh, picture's good. Excellent. Thank you. I think uh, who said that. I missed that. Uh, by the way, I only see about three or four lines of uh, chat at a time, so it uh, happens uh, very uh, quickly. Uh, when it goes by, so sometimes uh, I will miss things uh, very easily if the uh, chat gets busy, and uh, I will not try to uh, continue to give our uh, lowdown. Anyway, um, here we're turning uh, right, and I see that flash. Uh, somebody else is getting a uh, ticket for going too quickly. Ah, I know it's not me. Anyway, uh, we are getting on to uh, the uh, White Mud Freeway and uh, on the uh, Quinnell Bridge is uh, what this is called. And uh, we are going across it. So we are crossing the, <coughs> pardon me, we're crossing the North Saskatchewan River. And uh, that's uh, pretty awesome. Let's see what we can do here. Uh, sped up a little bit because the uh, speed limit is 80 kilometers an hour. And uh, if you want to put that in uh, miles per hour, uh, that is about uh, oh, 45, 46, something like that. It's all good. And um, we're doing all right. Edmonton is huge. Yes, Edmonton is huge. Uh, for uh, those people who don't know, Edmonton proper is at about one million people. And uh, with the uh, surrounding uh, communities, uh, we uh, peg it at uh, somewhere around a million and a half as far as the population is concerned. So it is... Uh, pretty uh, pretty big for uh, those who need to know it's not a small little hamlet and uh, let's see what this guy is doing all right now we are now on 149th street the speed limit 60 kilometers an hour and uh, we are doing uh, much slower than that so others are cutting us off <laughs> that's the way it works around here <coughs> see um, a helmet is what a small pig a hamlet is a small pig <laughs> oh you're putty a hamlet yes hamlet I thought hamlet was a writer in a small pig. <laughs> oh. Ham omelet? No, oh, no. I, I actually uh, didn't have any omelet today. By the way, the report on uh, my dinner, I did not have the dinner last night. I, I was just too full from eating breakfast and lunch and some snacks in the afternoon. Uh, so I... I, I couldn't do it. I thought, no, this isn't going to work. So 
so I let uh, it slide and I made it before lunch and uh, if uh, some of those people uh, who uh, were are there around lunchtime there um, they uh, did see uh, we put some pictures up uh, for uh, you guys to be able to see uh, what what it kind of looked like and uh, it was a pretty uh, decent meal I am still very very full and uh, it was my Rolladen, uh, kind of a German style, and uh, it was uh, pretty good. Uh, was, I'm going to say it was actually very good, but it wasn't as good as my mother's, okay? My mom has her own recipe. Um, some of them, obviously, I've never told anyone, but she is... Uh, a qualified master chef. She actually has chef, chef papers uh, from years and years ago, and uh, that was her trade. So um, that was a kind of interesting, and she is an excellent cook. And um, it's uh, pretty, uh, pretty awesome. Anyway, um, I'm not able to read a lot of stuff that goes on in the chat, especially if you're writing uh, stories like, uh, you know, where you put three or four lines worth of uh, material in. I can't, uh, can't read that, so uh, that's hard uh, for me. Anyway, uh, a little bit of black ice right here. We can feel it slipping a bit, but it's nothing uh, too severe. And uh, we are uh, coming up, or passing as uh, 95 Street, or 95 Avenue, and uh, this is uh, 149th Street that we're on. So uh, we are heading for Candy Cane Lane, and for those people who are not uh, with it yet, uh, that is what we are doing. So hopefully uh, you will all enjoy this. Uh, I know it's not quite completely dark. Actually, it's darker than what the camera makes it look. The camera is actually uh, keeping it uh, fairly bright. Um, over on the right-hand side, we already have some lights uh, showing there. And uh, Candy Cane Lane, of course, is uh, just uh, behind uh, the uh, stuff on our right-hand side, a couple blocks in. And uh, we'll be uh, there very, very uh, shortly. Uh, it looks like most of uh, the lights are on. We'll see what's going on there. And uh, we'll uh, get in there uh, right away. So, uh, let's see. Uh, they got roadblocks up. I'm just trying to see uh, where they've got the roadblocks. Okay, uh, traffic and delays. Yeah, no kidding. And uh, what do we got going here? Uh oh. Looks like uh, somebody uh, just had an accident. Oh darn. Oh boy. Yeah, you see it right there. Somebody hit somebody else. And uh, that's what happens when you are not paying attention. So, uh, that is unfortunate. <coughs> yep. And, uh, it is a little bit on the slick side out here, too, uh, just so you guys know. You know, it's not uh, that uh, great. And uh, look at that sign. They actually changed the sign to show uh, that it is a candy cane lane. I am amazed the street sign said candy cane lane. Uh, that is awesome. I'm going to have to uh, take a shot uh, when uh, we finish with this. I'll have to get a shot of uh, one of those signs, and uh, that'll be a really, really cool. Uh, let's see, I'm trying to open my window here a little bit. There we go. Uh, so, yeah, it's all icy. It's okay, though. We're not going like 100 miles an hour, so all uh, good. Uh, you guys can see those lights already on the uh, left or right-hand side. And, of course, the lights... What have they got on here? Community light stuff, all kinds of stuff going on here. This is, I guess, the uh, start of it. So uh, we are going to uh, be able to go have a peek. This is actually a pretty good one. I'm glad we don't have uh, that much uh, traffic right now. And uh, coming early uh, is uh, paying off. So uh, this is really cool. 
Let's uh, see. Let's uh, do this. Uh oh. Well, that didn't work very well, did it? Let me, uh, let me see if we can uh, clean that up a little bit. I'm going to flick the. Uh, what's this guy doing? I don't know what he's doing. I gotta turn my wipers back on and flip them. Well, just about. There we go. Okay, and that is how you do it here in Alberta when you uh, have ice on your uh, on your stuff. <laughs> if you turn your wiper on and you. Uh, snap the, uh, the wiper and uh, that'll help you out so uh, pretty awesome anyway uh, I guess uh, this guy is uh, pulling over so we get to it uh, oh maybe he isn't pulling over darn it I was hoping I was gonna say we get a free run down the road but uh, sure a lot of lights here you guys what state is this in it's in the state of Alberta Canada <laughs> I hope that uh, helped you out there, and uh, that is in uh, the Great White North. Uh, once you go uh, north of the 49, head up about 600 miles uh, north of uh, our wonderful, uh, uh, what is it, uh, Montana, Great Falls, Montana. Uh, go uh, north by uh, 600 miles and you'll be up here. So uh, yeah, uh, from here north, uh, next stop is Yellowknife, and then from Yellowknife is uh, Santa Claus, uh, the uh, North Pole. So uh, that is uh, where that is. But uh, this is uh, looking uh, pretty good. And if it uh, looks good enough, I think we can maybe uh, drive through it twice. Uh, that would really, really be awesome. And uh, I hope you guys are able to see all these lights so far. There is quite a few uh, going. and. I don't know if I'm going too fast or what the deal is, but let's uh, keep going here. And uh, hopefully you guys can see them. There's a lot of lights hiding behind the trees too and stuff. Uh, some of it are not quite as uh, good as others. Uh, whole uh, cluster, yep. There are lights everywhere. This is one of the uh, biggest uh, power draws in Edmonton. <laughs> uh, these uh, lights, uh, they actually had to redo the power lines in this area to, uh, to make this work. So uh, I'm kind of happy though. We've got a little bit more space and a little less traffic today. So this is uh, very, very awesome. And uh, I don't know if you can see the moon and just up on the uh, top of the screen. Here, if I can tilt it a little uh, there, you can see the um, crescent moon up there as well. That is <coughs> pretty awesome. <coughs> so, uh, very, uh, very cool. Uh, apparently, uh, this is a stop sign. Always stop. We uh, stop, we go, and uh, we're going to continue to go. And uh, let's see. There's only a few here that aren't lit up, you know, I'm, I'm very happy to see that there are quite a few of them that do have their lights on. Well, with the lights, thanks, FDG. Um, some of them don't show up so well, this guy doesn't have all his on yet. But I'm sure they will uh, get the rest of them on here in a due course. I like these uh, blue ones here. I don't know if you can see that. Those are pretty cool icicles over there. And that is uh, really uh, nice. Get you back in place there. And, uh, oh, you didn't know I could do that. I got it uh, so we can uh, pop it off the uh, mount real quick. And have, uh, have a nice look at stuff. Since uh, there is not that much uh, traffic, Undecided, I guess. Well, 
let's uh, keep going here and uh, the one on the left hand side is pretty awesome that's a fairly big tree at least uh, 40 feet 50 feet tall lots of uh, lots of impressive lights and they've got the uh, candy canes down on the bottom as well uh, that is uh, pretty awesome of course the other side is uh, well lit as well and uh, we can uh, see those other ones that is uh, pretty uh, pretty cool and uh, let's uh, make sure we're good there all right uh, yeah a couple of them here uh, just don't face the right way and they don't have lights on darn it they're grinches they're grinches i tell you those are not bad looking and this isn't bad and uh, of course uh, that one there is uh, very impressive the uh, icicles I don't know I just got a, a thing about blue icicles it's uh, really uh, neat to see uh, that so a uh, very very uh, cool and on that side of course you see uh, big old Saint Nick and actually, it shows better on the camera than it does on the, uh, the other uh, side. And then, of course, uh, over there, uh, we've got uh, the big sleigh happening. And uh, that is uh, pretty cool. And uh, I don't know if I did this last year. I don't, I don't think I moved the camera as much last year. But I figure, you know, we got a lot less traffic right now. So it's uh, not so bad to be able to uh, move that around a bit. Yep, very, very cool. And uh, more beautiful blue lights hanging in the trees here. Uh, that is uh, really awesome. And of course, uh, the, uh, these guys got their ho, ho, ho up there. And uh, that looks uh, pretty cool. And uh, there's the other uh, side of it, ho, 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 up there as well. And uh, some more on the other street. And then let's uh, pop you back on here and, and not go too fast. You know, there really are a bunch in here that aren't lit up this year compared to last year. And I'm wondering if it is uh, just uh, because of the way the uh, weather is or, or what it is. Um, I kind of want to show uh, these ones here. Uh, that is uh, pretty uh, neat. Uh, as we go by you can see uh, some of them are, are pretty awesome to uh, look at and uh, that one over there and then of course uh, this one over here you know really cool but uh, like those uh, candy canes uh, that looks uh, looks nice out there and uh, that is actually a pretty good uh, yard uh, let's uh, put that back there for a second keep going and actually uh, this uh, big teepee thing uh, we got to show uh, that that is hard to see and uh, they of course have uh, the other big uh, stuff in front of it so a uh, very very cool to see that that is a uh, well lit a very nice uh, display the next one right beside it also a uh, very awesome so very very cool you guys and uh, we missed uh, that one on the other side here and uh, more beautiful lights Put you back on here I'm uh, trying to uh, continue to drive uh, I'm not sure if I'm still on I don't see anybody chatting right now so I guess you guys are just oh there's more chat going on just took a break for a second or something no worries I'm uh, just trying to uh, get all of them and uh, it's hard to uh, see everybody so you know these lights are hiding in, in the corners and you got all kinds of snowmen and everything are going on that is uh, pretty awesome and uh, then we've got uh, this guy here that's pretty nice looking too and then uh, the next ones and we're coming to the end uh, down here but we're going to go back we'll uh, go back the other way and uh, we'll uh, see what we can uh, 
see what we didn't see on the way through, so <coughs> it'll be all right. And uh, let's uh, flip a U-turn. Oh, I hear the one on the end there. Going, oh, oh, oh. Hopefully uh, they won't run me over as I flip that U-turn. There we go. And we're heading right back the same way. So and now you get to see it from the other side, the other direction, and uh, it do does look uh, pretty awesome, you guys. And uh, hopefully um, you are enjoying this. Uh, happy holidays. Oh, I hear a bunch of side means. I hope nobody got hurt. I wonder if it's uh, that other uh, accident that we've seen that they're going to. Because that just happened, I guess, uh, just a few moments uh, before we got there. Mind you, they had a tow truck there already, so it couldn't have happened uh, just right then. There must have been something else. Look, Santa fell down. Santa. That's what happens when you get too damn drunk. Shanda had too much booze. He's uh, fallen down on the job. Holy mackerel. I uh, don't uh, let that get out. Uh, Santa has uh, fallen. Don't tell the kids, you guys. Oh, boy. Too much Christmas spirit is what the problem was. <laughs> and uh, I think uh, that is uh, what it is. Very, very uh, cool. So, uh, some awesome uh, lights in here. Really, really, I do enjoy these. You know, when we're looking at them from the other side, really, uh, really awesome. And of course, uh, very bright. So, a uh, very, uh, very cool. Anyway, and uh, they've got, you know, even a, a simple little uh, reindeer by a tree looks uh, pretty awesome around here as well so very very uh, cool and uh, i see this guy parked illegally oh uh, some kind of cleaner oh uh, sweeping us no uh, somebody asked something is that a moose i missed the moose <coughs> could have been a moose i wonder why uh, this guy is stopped he's got a uh, four ways on so uh, there we go. We get around them. If it is a moose, yeah, you know this is Canada after all, you guys. So uh, pretty uh, cool. Anyway, uh, they have that Grinch up on the corner here. I don't know how well you can see that. Actually, it looks more like the turtles, <laughs> and uh, that is a uh, pretty cool. And uh, that is that ho 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 guy, uh, but now we get to see uh, the other side, and uh, that is uh, not uh, bad looking over there too, as far as uh, some of the uh, wonderful uh, things. Yeah, this one says ho ho ho. <coughs> Sorry about the coughing, but uh, let's uh, put that uh, back there. That should be all right. And uh, we've got a few more lights going here. Uh, pretty awesome all right yeah I gotta like this you know when you got these uh, bigger trees and stuff uh, looking up you know they put a lot of light bulbs up there it's hard to get those lights up without a uh, lift of some sort and uh, that is uh, pretty awesome but it's less lights uh, than uh, last year. Uh, we uh, did have more last year, I think. Uh, by a few. Uh, it's not that many um, less, but some. And, uh, you know, just looking at uh, this side. Th this side is uh, pretty good, the uh, left side. Uh, but it's the right side. And that seems to uh, dwindle a little bit as far as the, uh, the amount of uh, lights that they've got. So uh, pretty cool, and uh, we I like that. But I do like uh, those uh, big trees up there. That looks uh, pretty darn nice. And then uh, getting uh, back to this side here, 
we uh, do see uh, those looks uh, really really cool and uh, you know it really does look like a Christmas scene lots of people out walking today oh uh, there's the Grinch he's stealing Christmas you guys uh, the Grinch is uh, stealing Christmas and uh, let's uh, put you back in here and uh, we'll uh, stop at the stop and uh, then we will uh, go again since it is a four-way stop and we can do that stop and go and uh, stop him no we don't want to stop him uh, how come uh, these uh, people are parked here can barely get by we gotta squeeze by this side they got the candy canes lit up and now over here that is a pretty cool another nativity scene and of course those bigger trees up there looking a pretty uh, pretty darn nice and um, yeah we kind of missed that on the way through uh, coming at the uh, other direction okay we gotta read this what's it say some kind of political messages uh, where are the floats? I have no idea where the floats are. Lots more candy canes there though. Uh, that is a pretty uh, cool and uh, a nice uh, job from them. And of course, uh, both sides here are uh, doing a pretty, uh, pretty darn awesome when you get right down to it. It uh, does uh, look good. So I'm gonna put you back on here again. I hope you guys are enjoying this and uh, now we're uh, coming uh, through uh, to the end here. I don't know if we want to take one more pass through after or not. Uh, maybe uh, something specific. Or uh, we can uh, maybe stop somewhere along the way. And uh, look at a couple uh, here and there. Uh, it is not that bad out. So if we uh, got to go for a minute or two, uh, it would be nice. Uh, there's a nice a little scene. Um, but I really don't want to walk. I'm, I'm stuffed. I'm full of food. So I really don't want to do that. But uh, we'll uh, see. Uh, there's those uh, bright ones over there. Uh, that is uh, pretty awesome. And uh, looking from uh, this direction, uh, this one on the corner this year, they're all blue, which is uh, pretty cool. And the other side, of course, uh, hang on, is this, this is not a four-way stop, but that guy has the right of way, so we'll let him go. It's better he goes anyway, that way we don't smack into anybody. And uh, we can just have a look at the lights. Uh, thank you so much uh, for taking us along. You are welcome, and uh, I'm glad everyone is enjoying this. It is our uh, candy cane lane uh, trip for this year, so... Uh, pretty awesome you guys and uh, this is uh, something you know I I enjoy um, it is uh, wonderful and uh, since I can't have, uh, have my own family along I, I've taken my lava family with me and uh, hopefully uh, you guys all are enjoying this uh, besides that my own family they you know they get them into the car here car be full and uh, here we've got the 64 of you in here and I can uh, still uh, move my arms uh, really well. <laughs> so uh, pretty awesome. I really do like this stuff on the corner here. This is uh, pretty nice and uh, as we uh, drive by some uh, Frosties uh, this is pretty much uh, coming to the end of it but uh, they do, do have some uh, nice uh, displays uh, right here. Uh, that is a very very cool and uh when we go look at them we'll, uh, we'll see that that's uh, pretty awesome you guys and uh, let's see i think uh, that is uh, just about it uh, for here i think i'm going to uh just uh, pull over here for a minute figure out uh, where we can uh, go messages uh, for a minute and see uh, what you guys are saying uh, you like the blue lights yeah I'm, I'm really partial to those uh, blue lights as well uh, very very uh, nice looking stuff and uh, I think uh, 
that is awesome. Um, actually, there's nobody around, or we're going to uh, turn the vehicle around. I'm surprised that there is not more traffic <coughs> here today. So, um, this is actually a pretty cool. And uh, we'll uh, just pull up right over here, just so we have some Christmas lights showing while we're doing this. That would be good. There we go. So now I can uh, sit here and read the chat for a minute. And uh, anyway, I want to say welcome to all of you. Uh, there are so many people in here and I can barely see this little screen the way it is. Uh, but I am hoping that uh, you guys liked our little run down Candy Cane Lane. I think we're going to drive back down it one more time. Because uh, today, you know, it was really, really quick. So um, I think we'll uh, do that if uh, if you guys are game for that. And uh, then, uh, but we won't won't come back a second time. We'll just uh, go down and uh, then uh, we'll uh, uh, shut it up down. Whoa, the chat is moving uh, so quickly. I can uh, barely uh, read that. Christmas lights uh, hunting and never uh, gets what something. Uh, things are moving so quick. I can barely read it. Lucas Snow, I see you there, and uh, good evening. Um, and Diane Craig, welcome. Uh, DJ's here, Grandma B is here, I see you. And uh, there's, you know, I didn't say hi to anyone, so uh, basically it's uh, I'm very difficult. When you're driving or a mobile like this, it's, it's a whole different story than when you are uh, sitting at home at a computer desk. <laughs> so, it is awesome to have you all along. And uh, wow, Linda Schoof uh, being uh, lurking on the roof. Merry Christmas. I missed what the rest of it said, but uh, thank you very kindly, uh, Linda. That is awesome. I appreciate that $50 super chat. Wow, I wasn't expecting that. Thank you uh, very kindly. <coughs> and uh, yeah, it is uh, downtown. Wow. Well, Let's, uh, downtown isn't as pretty as uh, White Avenue, so let, let's do it this way. Let's uh, take a trip back down here uh, through Candy Cane Lane and again, and then what we'll do is uh, instead of coming back through Candy Cane Lane, we'll get out on 149th Street, uh, go up to uh, 101st, and we'll go downtown and uh, we'll uh, see what else we've got uh, there. And of course, uh, from there, we can head over to uh, White Ave uh, back on the uh, south side. So uh, that should work. And uh, hopefully uh, you guys will be all uh, good with that. And uh, Piggy, uh, quit chomping on those candies while you're sitting there. You're, you're getting crumbs all over the seat. Piggy, uh, put your seatbelt back on. Piggy's not behaving. Piggy's mad because she won't let me let her put her window down. She's gonna freeze her nose off. The snout. Piggy's gonna freeze her snout to the window. <laughs> That'd be funny. <coughs> well, for anyone who has ever seen that, that in uh, in the movies and stuff where uh, somebody uh, sticks their uh, tongue on that uh, metal pole and freezes their tongue onto the pole. Well, that is a kind of like uh, what... Um, what, uh, what would happen if you uh, did it on a very cold day, even on glass, you will uh, freeze, your, uh, freeze your fingers to the glass if it's uh, too cold. So... Uh, that can happen, but glass, it's really got to be cold. You got to have minus 40 something uh, to uh, freeze your fingers to the glass. But uh, a metal, if you get a little bit of moisture in there, yeah, you uh, even at uh, minus eight degrees Celsius, uh, you uh, still stick. So, uh, pretty, uh, pretty cool. Anyway, I hope you guys are enjoying this ride. Oh, Mummy of Hamsters throws in a, a $10 super chat and says a little bit of uh, gas money and something else. Um, and 
sorry, uh, that goes by so quickly for me, I can uh, barely see it. But thank you very kindly, O Mummy of Hamsters and uh, Linda Schuf, uh, both. Uh, you guys are awesome <coughs> for uh, the uh, super chats. And uh, I go back and down here through a candy cane lane. And I hope, uh, you, you know, you're all enjoying this. This is um, a pretty uh, nice tonight. Lots of space in front of us, which is really good. We got a, a very clear view today. It's not like last year where it was bumper to bumper and uh, just no space. So um, being a little bit early today, I think, and also the fact that it is the uh, um, the 26th, lots of people are probably uh, are in the uh, same condition I am in, and that is too. Uh, too fat to walk <laughs> for the most part so I hope you guys are enjoying it and uh, Trek 15 says I'm loving it and that is awesome and uh, yeah lots of people out here though are walking which is really a uh, good and uh, it is wow uh, it is warmer I mean, I mean it's it's all right it's minus nine out now according to the uh, thermometer in the uh, van so you know, that's still it's uh, pretty good. Uh, we uh, don't mind that. Anyway, uh, we're uh, trucking along here. Hopefully, uh, we're seeing... I could swear there was a one or two houses in here on the right-hand side that had more decorations last year. Uh, somebody has uh, failed to do theirs. Maybe new owners or something, and they're not quite with it yet. So... And obviously, uh, they're not enforcing the uh, candy cane lane thing right now. It's kind of a free-for-all. Um, you know, they uh, normally have the uh, roads blocked off for the other traffic, and I'm glad that they don't uh, right now. So we get to uh, see uh, fairly well, and uh, really not that much traffic here, which is really nice. No oncoming headlights, uh, that makes things uh, so much nicer. Yeah, gotta love it, you guys. You know, they've got some little kids out, too. And I'm talking little ones here. That one looks like maybe about three or four or five years old. Just a wee little rug rats. And it's not too cold for them to be out, so it's, it's all right. is in here. I see a John Raper, welcome, and uh, Joss Dean, uh, welcome, Albert Girl is here, DJ we got already, Linda of course that we got, and uh, Lane and Lair also in the 4 our candy cane ride, uh, glad to have you on board, and uh, of course uh, what we're going to do after we get the, through uh, this, basically we've already gone down here once, and come back and this is the second time we're coming down and uh, once we get uh, finished uh, to the end here we're going to go back out onto 149th street and then we'll uh, go on to 101st avenue and take that in and uh, we're going to go to uh, uh, back to uh, downtown see what they've got uh, for lights there if any and uh, if not then uh, that's okay. We're going to go to uh, the uh, South Side White Avenue, and uh, they uh, do have some lights on, on White Avenue. And we'll uh, definitely be able to uh, see those. And so uh, that is uh, pretty cool. And uh, hopefully this guy realizes it's, it's not a stop sign; it's a yield sign, buddy. <laughs> What are you eating, um, Piggy? Oh, you know, you little candle or crayon crumbs. All right, quit giving Piggy crayons right now. She's giving crumbs all over the seat. Boy, you guys, that's going to be really hard to get out. Crayons uh, mushed into the seat. Oh, boy. I don't know what I'm going to do. Piggy... I'm going to get you a bib. <laughs> the bib will uh, keep the, uh, the stuff uh, safe from uh, 
It's one with a tray on it. You know those ones that uh, I don't know if you ever seen those. I seen them on uh, TV. Uh, they uh, they're like a, a little a plastic uh, tray at the bottom of the bib, and it's supposed to catch all the uh, the droppings at, uh, from uh, the uh, little ones. Uh, those are some awesome lights that those guys have over on the uh, right hand side there. Some uh, very uh, musical uh, looking uh, things. Actually, uh, we may just uh, cheat a little bit here for a second. And, uh, just kind of let you see what that actually looks like. That is a pretty awesome. Uh, different colors and uh, switching and uh, really a uh, neat gotta love it you guys oh some people walking by that's all right uh, they have the uh, music going to it as well but uh, fear of copyright I will not play any music on here or uh, listen to it but uh, a very very cool and uh, even the uh, candy canes are in sync with uh, the rest of uh, the light show. So uh, very, very cool, you guys. Gotta love it. And uh, that is always awesome. And uh, of course the other one, just in, uh, next to it is uh, pretty darn nice as well. And that is this, where we really, really like it. Uh, this is also the uh, place where they've got the uh, food bank uh, donation bins. So a uh, very, very uh, cool looking. Anyway, we're going to put that one back uh, forward and uh, keep going here before uh, we get uh, too much more traffic coming behind us. I see a few back there. deer out front here uh, that looks uh, pretty cool and uh, of course uh, they've got uh, the uh, lights going in there with the uh, snowflakes going around on the house uh, that is a uh, pretty awesome so uh, very very cool stuff and of course uh, the ones across the street so you know I think some of them living here may really enjoy uh, doing uh, their thing all the time it really does look pretty, you guys. And uh, gotta like it. Hey, Casey, I see you there. And uh, all right, let's uh, put this uh, back on here. And uh, we'll keep rolling. And uh, I just want to make sure it is secure enough. Yeah, I think it is. It's just on a magnetic back. And uh, that's what's holding it in place. So if... Um, if it drops, I, I'm not so worried about damage. I'm more worried about it uh, turning the stream off. Uh, that's not good for us. Uh, not while we're doing this. Anyway, um, that is uh, pretty cool for right now. And uh, we're coming up to the end of it. So what we will do is uh, what my uh, plan was. And uh, that is we will go right We'll go down to uh, one of the streets there, and we'll see if we can um, get that back out onto 149th Street. I gotta take a drink of Pepsi first, and wait for traffic to clear. pretty cool. I hope you guys enjoyed that candy cane lane run. And uh, we 
got some pedestrians we're going to wait for. There they go. And uh, we will uh, go over to 149th Street and uh, then uh, north. So all good. And that'll be at the lights up here. Maybe we'll see if uh, they got ambulances or something going on. Anyway, for those who are just joining, uh, I'm your host of Dr. Fox 2000. And uh, yes, we are mobile. We are in the city of Edmonton. And presently, we are on, oh, what is it? A 91st Avenue. I'm going to turn a no a north on a 90, oh, sorry, uh, not 90. Uh, this is 149th. So I uh, will uh, see. There we go. I get it. I'm going north. And of course, uh, we're in Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. The uh, Great White North. And uh, there we go. <coughs> no, Piggy, you can't put that out the window. Stop that, Piggy. Keep your nose in here. Piggy. Somebody's tell Piggy to stop trying to open the window. She's being bad. Yeah, you got caught. I seen you over there. You got that, uh, holding up that big blanket in front of you so I can't see you playing with the window switches. Uh -huh. Yeah, we know what you're doing. Anyway. Yeah, that's it. Stop it, Piggy. <laughs> You've been told. Anyway, uh, there we go. So, um, that does give you a pretty good idea, though, how far it is. So, we are paralleling it right now. So, from where we started to where we ended, um, that is uh, from uh, 91st Avenue. And we're going all the way up here to, uh, oh, we'll see uh, what the uh, Cross Avenue is up top here. But it is quite a stretch uh, for uh, Christmas lights in uh, one location. Um, although there are a few places here in the city <coughs> that are kind of competing uh, with Candy Cane Lane too. And uh, it is uh, kind of nice to see that, uh, you know, some places are getting uh, their spirits uh, back up there and uh, doing their thing. So uh, really uh, quite awesome that way. But, uh, yeah, we're already on 98 Avenue, so that's already seven blocks worth. And I think it's about uh, 99th Ave or 99A or something like that. So, uh, roughly about uh, 10 blocks worth of uh, Christmas lights, and uh, that is uh, pretty cool. And, of course, uh, this is uh, this is actually my uh, third time uh, doing this. And I think uh, that was uh, pretty awesome. Uh, they did clear the accident uh, that was here, and uh, that was right at this intersection. And I'm happy they uh, got everything out of there. Nobody is uh, damaged uh, beyond belief or anything. And uh, we'll uh, take a, a right-hand turn up here, and uh, we are going to go uh, downtown. Uh, so uh, this will be 101st Arab, I do believe. Construction cone changes. I wonder what they're doing here. Uh, possibly uh, building um, LRG, light rail transit, along here. That'll be uh, really good for them. And uh, let's uh, get to that. I can actually uh, turn that down just a tad. That's uh, probably better. Uh, what? Uh, black ice. Black ice in the UK? Oh. Okay. Uh, well, we got black ice everywhere. <laughs> it's all right. Uh, we uh, we get used to that. Uh, pretty much uh, driving on the black ice all the time. So uh, when you're here, you're you get educated uh, fairly quickly. It is a uh, pretty normal uh, for uh, good old uh, Edmonton. So 
Um, all right, what the heck is going on with this road? They have changed this so much that it looks really different. I haven't been here in a while. They've taken buildings out on the right-hand side here. And uh, wow, this is a really, really different. And uh, kind of makes me go, where the heck am I? Uh, <laughs> I better stay in this lane, never mind. Uh, what are we crossing here? We are crossing. I'm surprised. Holy mackerel, they uh, really uh, did a lot of uh, changes here at this corner. This is, I do believe, 142 Street. Uh, yeah, it's 142 Street. That whole left side, they've demolished everything. The right side is all gone. <coughs> they must be putting a uh, light rail transit in here, or as we call it, LRT. And uh, that is uh, pretty uh, cool. And uh, this is getting uh, back to our proper trek over here, I think. Some more nice Christmas lights at uh, this place. We uh, like that over on the uh, left of the uh, center there. Yep, uh, this is uh, certainly uh, changing and uh, from uh, what it was. Boy, it uh, changes uh, really, really quickly when you haven't been there for a while. Uh, it's a big time, a big time a difference uh, from, you know, last time I was out here, I didn't uh, see any of that. So a lot of construction that has happened there. That is uh, pretty wild. Anyway, and not too many Christmas lights in these areas. Uh, just a few here and there. I don't know if it's, uh, you know, economic uh, times uh, for some people uh, just having a hard time or, or uh, some people are just uh, not into the spirit of things. Um, I remember as a kid, you know, everybody had uh, Christmas lights up and uh, that was uh, very uh, cool. I'm uh, really enjoying this. Uh, thank you. Uh, thank you very kindly, uh, Diane, and uh, I'm glad uh, you are enjoying it. And hopefully uh, we can do this every year. I like this. It's always nice to uh, pop uh, through Candy Cane Lane. And uh, thank you kindly for your super chat. I really I do appreciate it. Anyway, we are on, uh, well, they actually call this 102nd Avenue here. And, uh, and we are eastbound right now. And we are going over the uh, bridge uh, that goes over a top of a Grove Road. This particular bridge is what was referred to as the, <coughs> pardon me, um, the Bendy Bridge. When they ordered it, they gave them a certain specifications. When the thing came, it was twisted. Uh, they uh, didn't know what to do and uh, they had all kinds of engineers come down and uh, they were talking about rebuilding the bridge or re uh, rebuilding the uh, surface uh, top for it and um, it uh, you know you throw another 20 million dollars at something uh, you can fix it that's how it works isn't it uh, just throw a lot of money at it and away you go Anyway, uh, they do have some lights down here on the trees and stuff, uh, so uh, this is pretty cool. <coughs> Pardon me, I gotta have another drink of Pepsi. The air is very dry out here. Uh, that's one of the things that we noticed. Okay, and there we go. We are now on a Jasper Avenue. Uh, Jasper Avenue is fairly long. Uh, that is the, the one that goes right through a downtown core. And of course uh, we are, well, uh, that was 124th Street we were on. Uh, this is about 121st here at these lights. 
and then I think I keep going. Let's see, is that the bus? I'm gonna wait for him to go out. Of course, the guy in the in lane next to me, he stops and sits in my dead spot so I can't see a darn thing, right? <laughs> I'm waiting for the guy to go by so I can move over and uh, he stops right in the dead spot. That's interesting. A data warning. Yay, I got a data warning. <laughs> uh, it tells me I'm using too much data. Uh, mind you, I've got uh, six, six gigs of data and uh, this is the uh, two gig data warning mark. So it's all right. Uh, let's see, a lot of chat going on there. I can't really read a lot of it while I'm driving, you guys. So, if you are asking me something, I'm uh, not able to uh, catch it all. That is uh, just because I'm busy. <laughs> Trying to keep everyone safe. And we are headed into a downtown. And uh, we are uh, coming up to 116th Street intersection. That's this set of lights. And uh, as we uh, keep going here, we are still on Jasper Avenue. Pay attention to the road. I uh, try. <laughs> oh, we are okay, Doc. All right, cool. And uh, that is uh, pretty awesome. And uh, boy, let's uh, switch lanes, everybody. This guy goes there, that guy goes here. And then they'll switch once they get uh, further up and uh, do it again. And that guy could have cleaned some more snow off his car, though, uh, the one beside me. Um, I always get a chuckle out of that. Uh, you know, at least clean your windows off. <laughs> that, uh, that really uh, does help. Uh, clean windows is uh, kind of important uh, for the most part. Especially if you uh, want to be able to see. You know, on the, uh, like here, the temperatures aren't that um, uh, warm right now, but in uh, some places when, uh, in the springtime and stuff, <coughs> where you get the uh, warmer temperatures, and uh, what can happen is uh, you will uh, drive along if you've got snow on your roof, and then you uh, have to hit the brakes uh, real hard, like uh, we're stepping on them fairly hard right now. Um, and uh, the, all the snow slides forward and comes down onto your windshield and you can't see a thing, right? Uh, so uh, hopefully uh, that is uh, something that uh, you guys avoid uh, from doing and uh, at least clear your roof a little bit if you're ever in that uh, snow condition, at least uh, the uh, front portion of it. And um, <laughs> it's kind of important. Uh, Teresa saying a fox fans, a yum, something, and away it went, and that is okay. Uh, yeah, had to ha happen uh, many a times, uh, Sarah, <laughs> there. Yep, uh, especially when it's uh, a little bit warmer. You know, when you get closer to that freezing mark, the uh, roof will uh, warm up a little bit, and uh, then all of a sudden, whoosh, off comes the snow. And, uh, it uh, pays uh, to uh, clean it off, it really does. Uh, anyway, we're getting into uh, what we refer to as the uh, downtown core here. And uh, this intersection is 109th Street. And that runs uh, north and south uh, from uh, left to right here. And uh, we are still on Jasper Avenue. And you can see uh, they've got more lights and stuff. But uh, looking uh, pretty awesome. It is a downtown Jasper Avenue here in Edmonton. Sirens! Uh-oh, we got the fire truck. It's a fire truck. Let's go to the fire. That's a rescue unit, uh, so uh, that is uh, probably uh, somebody uh, got hurt or something or uh, nothing uh, too, too uh, crazy. So we'll see. <laughs> oh, fire truck going around, other vehicles, uh, pretty awesome. Uh, 
And let's see. We'll stop here for the red light. How about that? And that is uh, let me stand next to your fire. No, no, no. Uh, uh, sit down and buckle up. DJ, no standing while we're driving. That is not allowed. <laughs> Boy, these kids in the cars here. How to stop them from doing that? Oh my god. <laughs> and uh, let's uh, carry on here. Of course, all the uh, red lights, every light is going to be red. Uh, I guess the uh, little park over here on the right hand or left hand side looks uh, pretty uh, lit up. All the trees are wrapped anyway. That is uh, pretty cool. And uh, I hope uh, the uh, picture quality is still okay. I know we've got a lot of uh, glare from uh, those other cars uh, with the headlights, but uh, we uh, should be all right. So uh, hopefully um, we're uh, doing all right. And uh, what uh, trust traffic? Uh, no. Hang on. I gotta be careful with uh, all kinds of traffic. A uh, doodle, a uh, doo doo, and uh, no, there is no doodle doo doo. Uh, we uh, keep an eye on everything, even though when the light is green. Or turn screen I still look left and right to make sure there's nobody coming <laughs> uh, the quality is okay doc I uh, thanks uh, Lucas and uh, awesome and uh, piggy has still got her nose uh, pressed up to the glass piggy you're gonna freeze your nose on there yet don't do that and uh, Let's uh, get a little a bit uh, further down here, and um, yeah, after the uh, big uh, towers at the end of uh, this uh, next long set of blocks here, we're going to uh, go to uh, the uh, right-hand side, and uh, we're going to go uh, through the river valley, and uh, we will see uh, what we've got going on over there, and then uh, come up uh, through... Uh, uh, well, we'll try to get over to, I guess, 99th Street will work. Anyway, uh, let's uh, take our, our turn here and get into the, uh, the right-hand turning lane. And uh, there we go. And uh, green lights, no pedestrians. And uh, let us uh, go uh, this way. So uh, this is uh, the, uh, the end of the road. See, we're going to drive right off the edge of the world. Oh, hang on. There is a road there. Uh, let's uh, go down the hill. Uh, so uh, hold on, everyone. Uh, we way down the hill. And uh, that uh, works. I hope uh, the uh, phone doesn't cut out. Sometimes it does over here, but uh, hopefully it won't. And uh, we'll uh, see if uh, this is okay. And uh, puts trotters up. Uh oh, yeah, keep them up there, piggy. Anyway, there we go. Uh, we'll uh, swing it the other way. So we uh, curve to uh, the uh, right, and now we're curving to the left. And we'll curve to the left some more again. And then we'll uh, kind of go right and uh, across another bridge back to the uh, south side. And uh, then uh, we will uh, get to going here. So let's uh, see. Uh, right about there. Yeah, left a little bit. Make sure that guy stops. Yes, thank you. And uh, then we go uh, right. And we're going uh, on the bridge, so hopefully our signal will stay okay, and we'll see what happens. It should be all right. Uh, I haven't had too much uh, trouble on this uh, bridge, and uh, we will uh, see what it is. Anyway, we are crossing the uh, North Saskatchewan River, uh, going uh, back to the uh, south side. 
uh, there we're on of the south side officially and uh, we are on what's referred to as Skona Road and uh, Skona Road uh, South 99th Street and uh, that is uh, where we're going I'm going up on 99th and uh, there he goes and that is uh, an all-wheel drive uh, Ford van um, there's a few of them up here I actually like those um, but uh, they are a lot of maintenance, unfortunately, uh, because uh, they don't come from the factory like that. You have to uh, redesign them. Uh, Moon was in that shot there for a second. I don't, don't know if you guys have seen it. Uh, that's pretty cool. <coughs> and uh, let's see if we can uh, get up the uh, hill here. Uh, this is uh, going back the other side, of course. So I'm back up the hill. Now that's not bad. And uh, there we go. And we are getting up to, yeah, we're still technically on Skona Road and uh, past this uh, set of lights here. It becomes a 99th Street. So uh, pretty cool. If you're following along on a map, uh, you should be able to see where we are. Anyway, that is a pretty uh, pretty awesome uh, so far. I'm surprised we're not seeing uh, anything. Um, you know, I, I would think there should have been a more Christmas lights even along here. Um, boy, these uh, businesses here are really not pushing it. <coughs> uh, very, very few uh, Christmas lights. I'm kind of disappointed, and that is... Um, not so nice you know you figure boxing day people will still have them on at least I would think and uh, pretty cool uh, oh goody uh, I made it a four candy cane a land, a what a, a huge uh, Kelly uh, you missed most of it uh, the but you did get in here at the uh, end part we've already been to candy cane lane and uh, we are uh, kind of driving uh, through Edmonton. We came out of Candy Cane Lane and uh, we are on the south side. We went through downtown and we are now uh, going to go to uh, uh, see what we can uh, see here on White Avenue or 82nd Ave as uh, they call it here. Uh, well, we call it White Ave. It doesn't really matter what you want to call it, but uh, that is uh, where we are going to go. And uh, they do have all the uh, trees here uh, wrapped as well uh, in uh, uh, lights, so I'm making it look a little a bit a bit more festive. Over on the right-hand side is K&K Food Liner. Uh, that is the deli I always go to, and uh, that is uh, pretty awesome. And um, anyway, uh, this. This is uh, between 99th Street and uh, 109th Street that we're going to show. And uh, we uh, do have a fair amount of uh, lights um, on the uh, trees anyway. Uh, they don't put any more on the poles. Uh, the uh, poles aren't really the right kind uh, for hanging uh, Christmas lights on, I guess. Uh, they used to uh, put stars and stuff up there, but I don't see any of them. And uh, that is uh, awesome. Glad you guys are enjoying this. And, uh, you know, going for a drive is always uh, pretty cool. <coughs> Especially if the signal's hanging in there. That is uh, really, really uh, uh, neat. So uh, hopefully I will uh, be able to catch a few more of these lights green. And that is always important. Oh, darn it. Uh, that one is uh, just changing. Yeah, well, we made it through. Uh, that's all right. Um, one of the things uh, that they do have now here at some of these intersections, they have a full, uh, what they call X crossings. In other words, um, you get to go, then the other traffic gets to go, and then everybody stops, and no traffic goes other than pedestrians. Then they can uh, go crisscross, uh, you know, uh, north south east west and then kitty corner 
um, northeast, southwest, uh, south, east, uh, northwest kind of thing. So I'm uh, pretty cool. And uh, yeah. Anyway, uh, this of course, uh, yeah. There uh, they uh, put up the. Uh, I don't know how well you can see it, but they uh, turned on the uh, the one sign there. Let me see if we can clean that window a little bit. Well, I didn't uh, really uh, do uh, that good of a job. I still got some ice on there on that wiper. Um, that's the other thing you guys always have to be careful of if you're uh, in this uh, cold climate. You want to make sure that um, if you got too much ice on it, if you got a chip in your window <coughs> and you uh, flip that uh, wiper on your uh, windshield, you have a potential of cracking your windshield, just so you're aware of that. <laughs> so, um, you know, that's uh, what happens in the colder climates like this. So, anyway, uh, this is a White Avenue, and uh, we uh, do see the uh, rest of the uh, wonderful lights and stuff. Uh, really uh, awesome. Oh, nice bus. I just pull out. I don't care about traffic. Ha! <laughs> I don't know if you guys have paid attention to that, but uh, yeah, that bus just pulled out like there was no, no vehicle beside him. I uh, wonder if uh, they uh, look in the uh, mirrors or something. <laughs> oh, bus driver probably distracted. Distracted driving, and uh, that is not good. But uh, there we go. Anyway, um... Yeah, we're just about at the end of 109th, uh, to 109th Street here. <coughs> Sorry, we're crossing 107 right now. Got to watch this bus so he doesn't pull out on me. Ah, uh, that's all I need is uh, a car accident. Uh, we uh, don't need that. Got insurance, but uh, it's uh, just one of those things. You just don't need the hassles. Anyway, and that is just about our uh, total uh, trek here, you guys. So what we're going to do is uh, we are going to pull into a, uh, a different 7-Eleven uh, here. We're going to turn around and then we will uh, go back the other way and we'll go back to where we started originally. And uh, that's where we will uh, finish the stream for tonight. So uh, we can uh, just uh, pull through here and uh, go right back out. This is pretty awesome. And uh, there we go. Now we are back uh, eastbound on uh, White Avenue from about 109th Street uh, to... Uh, uh, yeah, that is a 7-Eleven. You've seen it. Uh, we have lots of those here at DJ. Lots of 7-Elevens. Doc wishes a new van. Yeah, I'd like a new van. That would be nice. Actually, it would be. Uh, this one is getting a little old. Uh, we uh, we need to get that back to work and uh, be able to uh, uh, buy a new one, newer or something. I'm one of those guys who always looks at you know the sticker price on the new vehicle and uh, thoroughly shocked because uh, as soon as you drive it off the lot, it's worth a thirty percent less than what you paid for it. So if you buy a car for at uh, thirty thousand, and uh, you uh, automatically lose nine thousand as soon as you drive off that lot. Uh, so I uh, try not to uh, do anything uh, like that. And uh, ET, welcome. I uh, see you there, ET Sam. Uh, good to have you on board. And uh, let's see. Wonky Donkey Trevor, I see you as well. Good to have you here. And uh, let's see, who else is in? Uh, 
Old Nick, I see you in there as well. Oh, welcome. And uh, I'm driving again, so it is hard to see, but I do believe I see LOL, a Gemma, the Super Kitty, a Dave, and Claire. Welcome, if um, uh, that is uh, both of you. And uh, let us uh, see, where are we here? Uh, this is um, the right place. I need to turn here. Oh, uh, there's some people crossing. Oh, what are they doing? They're not. They're not doing anything. Anyway, uh, this is uh, just about it. Uh, so let's uh, see uh, what we can do here. And uh, well, I go up uh, just a few blocks here to, <coughs> pardon me, uh, to the uh, 7-Eleven. And uh, then uh, we'll um, basically uh, wrap up the stream. Uh, so far, we've um, been streaming, what, an hour and 26 minutes, an uh, hour and 27 minutes. That's pretty cool. And uh, it's been a very nice uh, little trick, uh, a trip out. So uh, do enjoy that. That is awesome, you guys. And uh, I hope all of you are enjoying this as well. It, uh, it's uh, very nice to uh, see uh, some of the uh, Christmas lights. in here for a minute and um, we'll um, do our thing yeah we'll pull in here oh hang on uh, I'm out there we'll go on the other side of the parking lot right back to where we started from that'll be awesome and uh, that was right about here and uh that is it so uh, there we go you guys all right and now i can uh i'm parked i can uh, take my seat belt off uh do people uh, hitchhike in canada um in uh, some areas it is still legal uh, some areas it is not uh, so uh depends on uh, where you are um and it's uh, too darn cold to hitchhike in some places it's actually <coughs> pardon me up, up in the northern areas if uh, up in the northwest territories and the yukon uh, there are uh, some areas that it is mandatory for you to stop and give uh, the, a person a ride uh, and it's and literally it's mandatory you can't let them uh, stay out there and walk so uh, that is uh, something to be aware of um, in uh, some places up there. Uh, let's see, what else? Uh, thank you uh, for a great uh, stream. You're very welcome. And uh, Tammy dear, by the way, uh, welcome. Uh, glad to see you. Yes, a neighbor. Night, oh, Nightbot. Nightbot, the big gulp. Yep, we're sitting in front of a 7-Eleven. Free advertisement for them. Uh, thanks for the tour, Doc. You're welcome. Uh, Lucas uh, Snow and uh, Linda Schoof, uh, thank you. And uh, uh, Piggy wants toe nuts. Oh, Piggy. Oh, I don't want to go to the donut store. I have so much to eat. Judy L., thanks and for uh, being here. And uh, Aloha, Kathy. I uh, lava lava you uh, bless you uh, bless your heart uh, thank you and uh, awesome uh, I'm going to rewind again all right Tammy dear uh, start at the front it'll look just like this that is where we started <laughs> it'll look uh, just about identical so uh, pretty awesome uh, 7-eleven a donut that will be fine <laughs> uh, no, uh, not for me. Uh, Krispy Kremes and, yep, Teresa, uh, back to Bunnyland. Uh, grateful. Yep, we're going to be back there soon. Um, this 7-Eleven is about a five-minute drive away from my place, if not less. Uh, it depends on if I'm speeding or not. Um, I can I'll probably make it in three minutes. So, uh, hopefully, that is all good. Anyway, I hope you guys really did enjoy watching the uh, the Christmas lights. 
and uh, thank you everyone uh, for being here also i want to say a big uh, thank you to the uh, super chatters you guys are awesome i uh, was uh, not expecting uh, that but uh, that is uh, very uh, very kind of you and i uh, really i uh, do appreciate that wonderful support and uh, yeah, it's not a full tour of Edmonton uh, there by any means, uh, Trevor, but uh, at least a little uh, chunk that you can uh, be able to uh, see what's going on. And uh, hey, has anybody seen that Irish monk in here? He said he wanted to drive. I told him, no, he can't. So <coughs> anyway, uh, that should be good. Uh, the next mall, no, no. Um, Maybe we'll do a, a West Edmonton Mall tour one day. That'd be neat. That is a huge, huge mall. Anyway, uh, for those good people, I don't know if uh, this button works. Uh, does this work? What does that uh, do? There. Good day, everyone. Okay, just so you see me. Switch back, maybe. Hmm. There we go. Now it's switched. Uh, be what? Oh, yeah, but I don't like seeing me. <laughs> anyway, I let everybody see me. I thought that was enough. Uh, so uh, that's all good. Anyway, thank you everyone uh, for being here, and uh, you guys are awesome. So, uh, on uh, those uh, friendly notes, as I always say with uh, uh, ending all of my uh, streams, please, everyone, uh, take care of yourselves, uh, stay safe. Uh, stay happy and uh, most of all uh, please please tell your loved ones that you love them tonight for tomorrow is never promised i'm your host dr fox 2000 uh, take care everybody a uh, good night and uh, oink oink thanks for being here bye oink oink good night oink